going on YouTube 915 Mang here doing an algae turf scrubber video uh, the screen itself is uh, called Yarnology I bought it at a Hobby Lobby I bought it red to stay true to my reef octopus downstairs in the sump and uh, it's gonna be really nice the size pump uh, pipes that you're gonna need is a three-quarter inch PVC pipe that's just basically gonna be the end cap threaded and a 90 street elbow Get some Teflon tape and then uh, some um, tape measure. I did buy some uh, gear ties there. They're pretty flexible. I'm going to use that to hang my algae turf scrubber from the uh, top of my stand. And there's the pipe, three quarter inch PVC pipe. Um, to cut the pipe, I'm going to be using a Black & Decker reciprocating saw. And that's just to uh, hurry up and get the project done a lot easier. Um, the next step that I did, I measured out how far I wanted the screen. There's actually formulas where it's a certain amount of number of squares equals the gallons of for your fish tank, but I don't have time for that, so I'm just going to use the whole screen. I've seen a lot of other people be successful using the whole screen, so that's what I'm going to do as well. I'm going to go ahead and cut this puppy down with this reciprocating saw. Really easy to do. And then uh, once you do that, you need to draw a line through your PVC pipe and go ahead and uh, cut it out. Um, I recommend using a Dremel. I had to use a jigsaw because I didn't have any more of those cutting pads. But the Dremel, Dremel is a whole lot easier. Once you're uh, done with that, go ahead and get your screen and throw it on the concrete. Scrub it up real good. And then once you think you scrubbed it up, scrub it up again and do both sides. Um, I ended up using a hole saw also to go ahead and cut this. And as you can see, while looking at the screen, it's pretty, uh, pretty rough. Which is also, that's where, how you want it so that the algae can uh, grow on it. There's a hole saw that I used. I manually did it with my hand and uh, it turned out great. So now I'm going to go ahead and uh, glue the uh, PVC pipe together. Um, I'm going to be using the purple primer and then I'm going to be using the um, small zip ties pinning on the end so that way the screen can be more secured and I don't have a chance of it falling out. That's how it looks. I used about four or five uh, zip ties and uh, get yourself some lineman pliers. I'm just go ahead and uh, snap it out, cut the ends, and then just slide it into the uh, groove. This whole project was uh, pretty easy to do, and uh, really didn't take any time to it. That's how it should look when you're done. And then uh, at this point, I'm just gonna go ahead and glue the uh, PVC, the uh, three-quarter inch street elbow, prime it up with the purple stuff. The purple stuff makes the PVC expand to get a nice uh, snug fit and then I'm just going to put a good amount of uh, cement glue on there. Don't be shy. I'm pinning a lot just because it's going to be up high. And Once you are done, go ahead and push it in snugly so that way uh, you don't have any type of leaks. Now you may be thinking what kind of uh, stand algae turf scrubber is going to be it's going to be secured to the top of the um, my stand the light bulbs that I chose to use were 5000k uh, compact fluorescent lights and uh, that's just an existing light fixture that I had um, the whole reason I'm using 5k is because I had it in my garage I know I've seen people use 65k and, and red bulbs so this is going to be fed through um, my reactor MJ1200 going through the bulk resupply uh, carbon GFO uh, as you can see I just used the existing uh, fittings you can get some more and it's just being powered by the uh, reactor that way I don't have any additional pumps or anything like that <clears throat> but anyways uh, I think the flows came out good and I'll just keep you updated on how it's going hopefully this will take care of some of the issues that I'm having in my tank and uh, yeah, the project came out pretty good. But anyways, guys, if you haven't done so already, go ahead and subscribe.